Hey folks, it's Rithgar here, how you doing? Welcome back to Minecraft. Ooh. Now, we just gotta hope that it's the one with the ship on it. What, so the ship's on it? Or do you mean on uh, the, the island? The ship is, like, next to it. It's quite a tall city, so there is a good chance that it does actually have what we want. Fingers crossed! Uh, what did you do to it? I didn't do anything. It glitched. I didn't even know it could do that. No. What did you have on you? Um, just what we said. I had a chest, food, pearls. Chest, food, and pearls. Uh. <laughs> it's not funny. Getting you back is going to be a lot more difficult. How did you glitch? Right, you're going to have to get it on your own. Cause we're going to have to... I'm not doing that again. Yeah, we, we, we need to redesign this machine. Yes. Okay, it, it just glitched again. Um, right, you're on your own. There doesn't actually appear to be anything in this city. There's <laughs> shulker boxes, obviously. Oh, oh, great. What? There's a ghast shot me as soon as I come out. And there's a pig thing coming at me. Okay. You're not having okay, a very good day. This was not a very good welcome. <laughs> Why are they being so mean? Just really I... like you. Right, there's one down. I've got to try and get back up there, but he's on top of it. All right. Where are you? Where's who? Right, there's no ship at oh, this now I'm end on fire. city. Okay, I shot him. I got a I think that's the first time I've ever killed a ghast. I feel very pleased with myself. I feel very pleased with myself. I just did a perfect landing on top of an end city. Okay, I'm not going to bother actually going for the... Ooh, I can see a second end city right from here. Hang so on. I can see shulker boxes. Hang on, what? Our path back, you know where the portal is? Yeah. Um, I just kind of, because of going there, gassed. Um, I can see, I just went a little bit further, and I can see one of our bridges. Hmm. Well, I'm curious where that bridge, what the bridge is for. Like which bridge it is. Uh, there's a big lava ocean between me and it, so I don't really want to... Because I thought this we were going in the opposite direction to anything else we'd been to. Yeah. I don't know. Alright. I did just go inside the end city just briefly to... Um attack something. Uh, to just oops. I'm shooting off all my rockets now. Really? I gotta be really careful with that. Alright, you know what? I'm not gonna try fighting a whole load of those. Um and I don't want rockets there. Um I guess I ought to put rockets just down on my hot bar instead. Just while I'm doing this. Eat the tatey po and I'm going to not go into the city and attack things, despite the fact that I actually really, really like to. I'm going to just gather a couple of end rods. Around the edge here. Uh, I won't bother with the banners. I want to go over to that other end city and see if that is one that we want. i got a feeling it might be. So I need to... Launch. There we go. Right. There's the end city. Is the... Is there a ship? That is the smallest end city I have ever seen. It's not a city so much as a tower. This it's isn't literally, going well. It's literally just one tower by itself. 
I'm going to try and come in for a smooth landing. There we go. This one does at least have a couple of chests in it. It's also got a whole load of shulkers that are currently trying to shoot me. Have you found my elite tree I yet? I thought that was going to be his undoing. Ah, there we go. Right. Okay, so I got him. He didn't actually drop anything more. And I'm just going to have a look in these two chests. And then I'm going to continue flying on. So I got two emeralds. I got seven diamonds. Four bits of gold. I got an iron chest plate with mending, fire protection four, unbreaking three. That's pretty good. Diamond pickaxe. Efficiency four, unbreaking three. That's not bad. Yeah, considering we don't have... Oh, we, yeah, we do have an efficiency five, don't we? Uh, yeah, don't we do yeah. um, two fours? No, we've got efficiency five. Um, oh. There was another one that we've got at five. Uh, is it... Uh, the, the sword one, actually. Sharpness. We got sharpness yeah, efficiency. Four. I have to do four. Two fours. I'm pretty sure. Don't tell got... me I've been doing two fours. Pretty sure we got no efficiency reason. five now. Oh. That's I've got efficiency four, unbreaking three on a shovel as well. A diamond shovel, too. Uh, so we've, we've basically got two decent shovels there. That's good. Yeah. Uh, that's in that chest. The other chest, we've got Fortune 2 on a pickaxe, which isn't so good. Um, beetroot seeds, a couple of gold, uh, Protection 4 on some boots. So Protection 4, um, to get up... Well, that's actually maximum, Protection 4. So Protection 4 on diamond boots, that's brilliant. Because I think we've only got a Protection 3 anyway. Oh, I, I got an Iron Pickaxe with Efficiency 4, Curse of Vanishing... Mending and unbreaking three. So I don't think there's any way to remove. But then it's uh, it's iron, and then there's iron boots with protection, curse of vanishing. But I mean, if I take those, we can just dump those into the smelter. Not to worry about those. So the iron stuff. But yeah, I'm gonna take it anyway, just because I'm here. Uh, that'll probably do. I think I'm going to head north. Uh, is it south or north? North. Oh. Right, I'm on this lonely tower all by itself, but I see, I'm so glad I've turned the server distance, the render distance, up to 20. So I can see a nice long distance. And we don't seem to be getting any lag either, which is good. Uh, but I just see, I can spy a ship off in the distance. That's what oh, I'm Oh, yay! Um, right. I'm just trying to... I'm putting up signs so that we remember... Which is which in the nether. Ah, right, yeah. Okay, there doesn't seem... Oh, yeah, there's a full end city here with this ship. Uh, I'm... Gonna... Cruise in gently on the ship. And go right inside. And then there's the Elytra. I can take out the shulker box. Once you got one Elytra, it is apparently very, very easy to get more. Um, Elytra? It's also still just as easy to lose them. Please, please don't die. I have never heard you sound like you actually care for me as much as you sound like you care for me at this moment in time. I don't know what you're talking about. It's very touching, Sen. I could almost believe that it is because you actually care for me. Oh, don't Almost. be daft. Yeah. Uh, ooh! <laughs> okay, what? Diamond Pickaxe, Efficiency 5, Fortune 3, Unbreaking 3. Really? All we have to do is add Mending to that one, and we've got ourselves another one of our perfect pickaxes that we use. Nice. Uh, we've got a Diamond chest plate with Protection 4 and Unbreaking 3 on it. So all that one needs is Mending, and we've got one that has everything that we have on it. There's a brewing stand here that's got two potions of instant health too, which I'm going to use for some of my fights, and I'm going to take the brewing stand as well. I like that one. Right. Let's go out here and get this shulker box. If I can. He's just shot I'm going to build a boat. Okay, he shot me several times. I want to get the dragon head. So, oh, 
Where's all these other shulker boxes coming from? Let me come down here. Uh, did lag a little bit there, because um, my enderpearl kind of like shot in, and then I didn't immediately follow it. But there's, it looks like there's some shul extra shulker boxes out on the outside. Oh yeah, I see them. All right, I'm going. I'm going to go in behind him, and I'm going to get him. Eat that a minute, and then I'll go like that. Got him. Nice. Excellent. Is there another one over here? Right, there isn't one over that side. I know where there's one up on the top, so I can go and grab that one a second. Just go up like this. There. Take him down. Don't know if there'll be another one. I'm not going to bother going after anything else over here. I will... Just glide down effortlessly like that, though. And then we'll come out over here. Right. In order to get this dragon head, I think I ought to build something out underneath. Because it's directly over a bit of void. Which ain't helpful. Ain't. Ain't helpful at all. So, I don't know. Oh, there we go. Right. I have a dragon head. Second dragon head. I've got the Elytra I'm just carrying around on me rather um, than putting it into an ender chest. I'm thinking I should probably put it into an ender chest. Probably should have done that already. Uh, can dolphins be mean? I uh, don't know. Maybe don't hit them. And then okay. you won't have to it's find just, out. Um, I keep, there's this dolphin thing that keeps coming up in the corner of my screen. Hmm. I didn't know think if you knew what it was. I think dolphins are friendly. Right, I've got one spare elytra now in my ender chest. I'm going to keep going north and see if I can find any more. Cuz if we can have like a couple of spares, that would be really awesome. I wanted to get a spare Elytras, like, so that we'd have a spare one each, but I'm, I'm starting to think that maybe that's not such a, a good idea, so I will find somewhere to sit safely. Not in this room, this is another room that is full of shelters. And whilst it would... How did they all miss me? I got all of these bullets going for me. There's a shulker uh, case that just fell to the floor. All right, let's have a look in here. We've got an efficiency four diamond pickaxe, unbreaking three, mending thorns two, protection four. That's pretty good. Uh, we don't generally use thorns on anything. And we've got projectile protection and mending there, and then a few bits of iron. Okay, fine. Um... I could go and fight my way back through a load more shulkers. There's lots of them down there. The Enderman is currently trying to fight them. He's also really mad with me. Yeah, he seems really mad with me. He can't reach me, fortunately. Right, let me go over here. Actually. Okay, I have taken everything off. Everything I own is now in that ender chest right there. I have nothing. Not a single thing to my name. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to drop down here. And I'm going to drop down further still. And what I'd like to do before I meet my untimely demise is look at as many Endermen as I can and see if I can beat the Endermen. <laughs> you didn't get me. <laughs> Frithgar fell out of the world. And there we go.
Okay, so in theory, I should have an Elytra and all of the other stuff that's nice and shiny in there as well. Uh, Sen, your bed is still here in Stronghold. Yeah. So I, I was will... just going to leave that there. Oh, have you respawned? Have you set your spawn point somewhere else? Yes. Back at the base. Right, okay. I'm digging up my bed and then I'm going to perish once more. Right, I have set the server back to a more sensible 12 chunks on the render distance. It is possible to run it higher than that without too much trouble, but you do need to both be in the same world generally. If you've got one of you uh, in one realm and one of you in another realm, it does make life a little bit more difficult for the server. Um, it's very, well, if you, if you got it somewhere, 15, it would probably do with two. Um, I'm not really sure. I, I mean, one thing that we were just talking about is that we think that perhaps the chicken farm does contribute quite a bit to the lag that we experience whenever we're not at the main base because that's in the spawn chunk. So those chickens never actually unload. And so what we're going to do is fairly soon, we're going to get rid of the chickens completely we may even do that like now in a minute and then we don't need to worry about that anymore we won't have that extra lag coming from there um the sheep are probably also causing bits of lag as well which isn't going to be helping matters and so if we get rid of the sheep we i mean we could keep one or two sheep in the spawn chunks that's not really going to make much difference uh, same with chickens really but the sheer number of chickens that we've got at the moment and the sheer number of some of the other things that we've got in the spawn chunks with the animals, um, we think that, that isn't helping. I don't know quite how... <laughs> what? Got into this, you just drowned. Yeah, that was deliberate. Oh. I, I thought you already died. I died Why in the end. Why are you dying again? I died in the end. Now I just died back at the portal so that I could come straight back to the base. Nice and quick Laziness. and easy. Laziness. Easy way. Not lazy way, easy way. Why is the, what types of ice are there? You've got... Uh, hang on. There's, there's ice. You have I've got ice. Loads of packed ice. Yeah, you get ice. Uh, nine of those makes one packed ice. Nine of those makes one blue ice. Didn't we get blue ice? We've got some blue ice, but we got those from digging up some igloos. Oh right, I'm just digging um, an iceberg. Oh right. Okay, I'm gonna try and come to you now. Before I do that, I'm going to unpack all of my stuff here. I've got a mountain of stuff. This Sounds is... like a machine gun. What does? Um, breaking this um, ice with the pickaxe. Oh, does it? Alright, I want to take all of that out of that chest there. So that's the project chest, although we don't actually need that chest at the moment. So what have I got here? That's my silk touch mending and breaking three efficiency five. So that's the one that I want to keep. This lot here is spare stuff. Oh, that's my standard sword. All of this iron stuff, we will, like, despite the fact that it's got a whole load of decent uh, enchantments on it, I'm still going to just chuck it all in the smelter. I'm not going to bother um, keeping any of that. There's loads of ice um, in the water, but I'm worried that if I go under there to get it, I'm going to get stuck. Dig through it. It, but it's, well, it's the, my worry is because it's flowing. Oh. Uh, I don't know then. I mean, I have got lots and it's coming back um, pretty quickly. Yeah. I don't know. I have got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine stacks. Mm hmm. That's pretty quick, isn't it? I'd say that's all right. It's acceptable. We got nearly two full stacks of end rods. 
and a few other bricks and stuff. And we got 45 shulker shells, which is enough to make 22 shulker boxes, which is not a lot when we, you know, eventually we start sort of building up a lot more storage. But for us at the moment, it's plenty. Now, I'm just going to get rid of a couple of these other bits. And then I'm going to go and find Sen. Um... Actually, I don't want to go and find you yet, Sen. I want to get some enchantments put on this new Elytra of yours. Oh. You'll have to come back to the base. Unless I come out to you after I've put enchantments on it. No, you need to come back to the base. That's what you need to do. But there's ice. Yeah, we'll get the ice another time. We, we, we will work on the ice, don't worry. But so you sent me all the way out here. To get and a little bit of ice, yeah. Beckoning me back, pretty just much. like that. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, I snap my fingers and you come running, just Food. like that. Okay, I'm getting a little bit before I leave. Okay, I got to get some levels of XP so that I can put enchantments on your stuff. Uh, oh, so I don't need to leave yet. You have to go right away. No, I'm just going to do a little bit of trading in a second. I'm just trying to find where have you put the? Oh, I suppose the diamonds would go in here. And that's yours, and then... Oh, I thought this, um, you know the sort of zombie things in the water? Yeah. Um, I thought he was holding a brain. Oh. But it's a shell. Oh, it's but... a Nautilus shell. Yeah, but I, Those, I, I honestly you... thought it was a brain. Did you get it? Was it a drop? Yeah. Ah. Uh... Oh, are they good? Yeah, you use them to you know, the Nautilus shell, and there's something else that you get as well. I can't remember conduit, I think it is, or unless you make a conduit with it. But yeah, you need a Nautilus shell as like one of the ingredients for this thing. Yeah. Um, it it makes something cool. Cool. That's, yeah. Um, it's basically it works like a beacon, but it it's an underwater one. Oh right. It's well, sort of works like a beacon. It's a little bit different to it. I've got two blocks of crying obsidian right here, which I want to use. Right, that worked fine. I can fly just perfect on there. So anyway, I want to use these two blocks of crying obsidian to place down the first blocks on our um, crying obsidian pyramid. So we're going to place one right there, and then I'm going to remove that, and I'm going to place the other one right there. So that is our crying obsidian pyramid. Is it massive? It's absolutely enormous. We've got two blocks down, 176,000 to go. No problem. Yeah, we haven't even begun to think about building the brick one over there. We've got a lot of work to do yet. We've got a lot of work to do. Right. Uh, let me go over this way a minute. I'm wondering if the villager farm, the villager breeder, has had anything to do with the lag that we've been experiencing. I don't think it has. There are a lot of villagers in there. That's possibly something to do with it, but I don't think villagers have that much of an impact. What I think is the biggest problem for us for lag at the moment... See, I don't know if animals... I think animals still continue to do stuff in the spawn chunks, even when you're not sort of around and using them. So we've got all of these sheep here. There are quite a few. And they're going to cause a bit of lag. We've got bees around, which obviously they take up a little bit more. So there's a bit more lag there. There doesn't there. seem to be that many working there anymore. No. I, the big thing, though, is the chickens. We've got such a lot of chickens here. And it is a bit of a mess, this thing. We've got there's quite a lot of hoppers on it as well. And I believe hoppers can cause bits of lag. But, yeah, look at all these chickens. So there's it's all that, your fault. Yeah. There's all that lot down there. And then we've got loads of them up here as well. They must be on the verge of entity cramming in there. So I think the time has come to dismantle the chicken farm. I think we're going to have to dismantle it completely and rebuild it elsewhere. We won't do it yet. But the chicken farm is days are numbered, basically. 
Its days are now numbered. We've got a double chest full of... See, the eggs are all going the other way now. And none of the eggs come down here. Um, but that one's full of feathers. The feathers are up here. So is the chicken. So we've got two double chests full of raw chicken and feathers. I am... While I'm waiting for you a second... I'm drowning! Are you? It's in layer one, drowned. I'm just Ta -da. going to go in here because I think we had something that we wanted yellow dye for. Oh, right. yeah, that's I what can it hear was. You. Where am I? Yeah, I can hear you. I'm uh, over here. Hi, oh, I yeah, see you. Yeah, over here. You can you can hear the um, seeds oh, dropping through the bone meal thing. Um, so that was you digging. So I'm just gonna hit that one and set that one going, isn't it? Oh, it went laggy. Yeah, it does. That thing does create a lot of lag. That creates a lot of lag, that little beastie. But one of the greenhouses that we want to build is orange for the carrots, yeah? Yeah. So we're going to need a load of orange dye, which means we either need to mix yellow and red from the two flowers we get from here, or we need to go and find a load of tulips. So yeah. I vote we just make some here, because I've been composting all of the yellow flowers. Oh, right. So, you need to stop doing that. Very noisy again. Uh, let me see if I can just... So, what? Stop! You're such a musician! There. Well right. done. Help me pick everything up and put it in chests. Okay. And then I'll give you your reward. I have. Right. You 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 have to I don't you have, have to lot. you have to earn the prize. Okay. Uh, put oh. yellow flowers in the single chest on its own. Put okay, red I have flowers. Two yellow flowers. And put two red, flowers red flowers in the bottom, and then the seeds. Bring them over here. I have one seed. One. Um, you picked up most of it, so I only managed to get four flowers and a seed. Oh. We couldn't have done this without you, Sen. I know. Dump that lot in there. It's the moral right. support. It's important. Okay, so you want one of those. Woohoo! Reach the goal, the sky's the limit. And you also want... Oops. Uh... Unfortunately, folks, that is all we have got time for today. A massive thank you to everybody who has earned their way into the Great Book of Names. To find out some more details about all the names coming past, please head into the description and click on the link to the Discord. It's a link to another video. The link is on the other video. Uh, please also consider checking out the links there for Nitrado, who provide gaming servers for games like Farming Simulator, Minecraft, Ark, and several others. And there's also Fanatical, who will help support your gaming habit by providing you with cheap games and also giving me a small commission on anything that you buy using my link. Uh, if you've enjoyed this particular video, then please head down below and give us a like. And if you really enjoyed it, then please tell your friends all about me. Get them to come and watch as well. That would be awesome. And until next time, thank you very much for watching. This is Frithgar. Goodbye, and see you later.